YouTube, Kevin here, Candy Banana Balls. I uh, wanted to do a video. Um, I don't have any animals that are suffering from this, so I'm just going to show you uh, a male that I just placed in with a female while I talk about this to give you something to stare at versus me. But um, something I see commonly misdiagnosed and or uh, some people just don't know what it is, is you'll see a snake that has a dented eyeball um, and people freak out what what is this um, and a lot of people start telling them hey this is a stuck eye cap from a previous shed and people start messing around with these snakes and trying to get this stuck eye cap off when it's really not that uh, in most cases that I've come across it's it's because the first stages of dehydration in a snake that's one of the signs. The eyeball is going to indent like it has a dent in it. And um, it's pretty easily remedied. Um, usually doesn't require anything severe, vet visit, anything. Um, you could go ahead and do like a humidity box. That would be a very easy treatment. Or even just up the humidity in the uh, enclosure itself. Um, also a nice thing and something I wanted to kind of bring up is... How often are you guys changing and or cleaning your water bowls and giving these, these guys fresh water? Um, you know, ball pythons, for the most part, when you have, you know, the heat and humidity kind of on point, they take care of themselves. You know, they're, they're not high-maintenance animals. But I think a lot of times what we forget is, you know, they do like fresh water, um, clean water. And I, I've seen a lot of videos and I've seen a lot of people and even pet stores where I'm betting that water's in there for weeks and weeks at a time. And it's, you know, it's gross. Um, you know, you should be pulling these water, uh, water bowls and cleaning them, in my opinion, probably every three or four days, cleaning them, fresh water, um, always topping off water, you know, every couple days. Uh, they don't drink a ton, um, especially if you have larger water bowls in there. You know, water would last them a long time. But these these guys are soaking in it a lot of times. They're crawling through it. They're dragging in substrate. Um, it's a good idea to keep fresh water in there. And you don't know, but, you know, that, that might become an issue where, you know, that water's contaminated enough where the snake's now not drinking it and becoming dehydrated and you just don't know it you know hey there's water in there he should be fine or she should be fine and it's not drinking because the water is contaminated dirty you know something something to that effect so you know make sure you're giving these guys clean fresh water and clean water bowls you know at least minimum at least once a week um you know i, I would recommend every two three days cleaning out their water bowl and making sure they have nice fresh water if not daily i mean I, I know that seems like a lot of work if you have a lot of snakes but um you know that's important uh very important you know these guys can go without eating a long long time but without water uh you know their their lifespan is going to be very short-lived if there's an issue with their water so uh to prevent that to happen you know with a dented eye cap or eyelid or eyeball whatever you want to call it um, you want to make sure um, you know you clean water so they're they're always hydrated and the and the humidity if that humidity if they're in dry humidity and even if they're drinking they could start to suffer from that and get a dented eye eyeball and you will see this and sometimes freak out you know what the heck is going on it looks really severe um, but it, it's not it can be corrected usually within 24 hours if you get them hydrated and, and get their humidity up or build a humidity box and let them in there for a while. Um, you know, they, they drink water, but they also like absorb it through their environment or through the humidity in the tub. You know, their skin um, it absorbs that and as part of their hydration. So the humidity is very important. You know, when you're, you're trying to average a 60, 60% 60 humidity, um, but if you're falling below that, you know, quite a bit, um, yeah, they can get they can get dehydrated, so um, it's important. And I just wanted to touch base. I didn't want to make a long video about it and be boring, but um, I just wanted to tell you keep their water bowls clean, fresh water. And if you do come across the dented eyeball, um, make sure that you try that first um, because a stuck 
a stuck eye cap is very very different from a dented eyeball and you're going to do your snake a lot of damage if you're there picking at trying to get a an eye cap off that doesn't exist just because you have a dented eyeball so uh thanks again for listening hope you learned something please uh, like and subscribe and uh, i got some some pretty cool videos coming up and we're also going to do a t-shirt giveaway soon so uh stay tuned and have a great day thanks guys <laughs>